What's poppin' everybody? It's your boy Aaron back at y'all with another video. Y'all didn't think I would help with a second video today, huh? Y'all thought wrong. This video is gonna be a little backstory about me. I know I did that in the first intro in my first video with the introduction to the YouTube community, but I wanted to give y'all a more personal and a more serious tone about my life growing up. Okay. As y'all know, my name is Aaron Ryan Robles. I'm 18 years old, and I hail from Corpus Christi, Texas. That's located down way, way south. I mean, like, way, way south. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, I'm 5'7", I weigh 160. Also, if you know me very well, very, very well, I have a high high fascination for shoes that's that's a given like it's a damn given <laughs> but uh i also have a love of making new friends um making new friends is amazing thing to me like you have no idea what could come out of making a new friend y'all could become you know like a family Y'all could become like brothers or like brother and sister or even more, even more than that. But that depends on you and the person that you made a, you know, new friend with. Um, growing up, I come from a good household, a good mom, a good dad. Um, I, w I would say at about the age of, the age of five, I started to see things differently that I wasn't, uh, that I didn't know that I had until I was about 12 years old. I will get to that in a bit though. But, growing up, I came from a good household, like I said, a good mom, a good dad. Um, mom was always busy, dad was always busy too, but, um, my dad suffers and still does from alcoholism. My dad is a drinker. Um, it bugs me a lot, I'm not gonna lie, because she can get out of control when drinking too much. Uh, my mom is a hard worker, she's the hardest worker I've ever met in my life. I love her beyond death. She's been through some of the toughest things in life ever. Um, from, you know, growing up, having to work two jobs at 16, having to watch over her family you know, pay bills and come to where she is today. That takes a strong woman with a strong heart and strong mindset. Um, she has had battles with cancer and she has prevailed, which I'm very, very, very thankful for because I honestly, I had no idea what I would do without my mom. Um, by y'all know, mainly everybody knows, I have a younger brother. His name is Tristan. He is 10. It's gonna be 11 in September this year. <laughs> Dude is a little fucking shithead. I'm not gonna sit here and lie about that. Dude's a shithead, but he loves me so much and will have my back like I have his. So that's my mini me. Um, he's going through a time right now, but I know he's gonna get through it. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I attended school at Telosa Midway from kindergarten to halfway through my freshman year. Uh, my freshman year, I transferred out from Telosa Midway to Cal Allen High School, which is probably one of the top high schools in the state of Texas, sports-wise. Um, their, their football team is outstanding. You know, their school is also really great. Um, the time I was there from Cal Allen was my freshman to junior year. My junior year, I transferred back to Teloso. I had a lot happen in Cal Allen, from the amounts of excessive, of excessive bullying to, you know, having people wanting to fight. Uh, that was also during the time where I was a player. I, I, in my life, in my life, from the ages of 13 to 17 
I was a player. And I'm so glad that I stopped, you know, being one because it really takes a toll on you when you cheat on somebody and their heart is broken. But anyway, I explained that in my last video. Um, if y'all haven't uh, seen it, go go look at it. <laughs> but as I was saying, Callan was uh, were rough years for me. When I came back to Toloso, um, it was smooth sailing. I joined the ROTC program because my goal was to be in the military and make it a career. Which I explained that in my second video. If y'all haven't seen it, go look at that too. Uh, leave a like and subscribe. Um, but unfortunately it didn't work out. And um, I know how I told y'all. How I just said I started seeing things differently when I was five. Um, when I was 12 years old, I went to a doctor's appointment. And they had said that. I look at I look at things differently. So they ran a test and everything. Um, it came out to be that I, Aaron Robles, was diagnosed with autism. Um, I know it doesn't show much, but doctors don't lie. So I am of the spectrum, and. Not really much to say about that. Um, I'm 18. Not really much to say about me. <laughs> um, like I said before, I have a, a high love for shoes and making new friends. And <clears throat> excuse me. And um, I just want to say to everybody. Who has been bullied. That has been bullied. Have had suicidal thoughts. And. Have actually attempted suicide. And for all. The people that have been diagnosed with. You know autism. Down syndrome. You're not alone guys. You have somebody. You have a lot of people. You have a lot of people that care and love for you. Um. I have a lot of people that are behind my back that I never would have thought possible because like I bullying took a heavy toll on me I don't know if you guys can see it well but I have scars on here from bullying and from certain issues but I just want y'all to know that if y'all are going through a hard time in your life and that, you know, you feel like that there's no, that it's never going to stop, it's going to stop it at some point, trust me. Um, suicide is a very serious issue and I've lost a lot of friends to that, um, especially a really good friend from Cal Island. <clears throat> You're never alone. You're not alone at all. Trust me. Um, if any of y'all have any suicidal thoughts or actions, y'all can always reach out to me. I'm open to anybody, to anybody's problems that feel like they're going through a hard time, that feel like that there's they have nobody that they can talk to. I'm here for y'all, no matter what. I love all of y'all. Y'all are my friends and my family. And, um, <laughs> um, not really much to say at this point anymore, but, um, <laughs> uh, sorry guys, I'm like, at a loss for words right now, but that's going to do it for this video. Leave a like down below, subscribe if you're new. I said it in my last video, we are at a quarter at a quarter of a hundred. I'm so happy. Let's get to 50 this time, guys. Let's get there. I know we can do it. Um, more videos are coming soon. I will be dropping a lot more this week when I get the chance because, like I said in my last video, I've been working. I just started work, and I will be busy a lot. So, 
when I'm able to have time to, you know, make and edit and upload videos, I will let y'all know. And um, these next videos that are coming up are going to be lit. <laughs> so, leave a like down below, comment, subscribe if you're new. And that's going to do it for this video. Later, guys.